Hey guys, Dan here. I just got a Dev Pro VP for you. This time I'm playing my Cyber Dragon deck, and yes, it is inspired by the uh, I forgot his name. I think it was Br his name was Brandon something. Is a French gentleman from the EU. He uh, did pretty well in the uh, European WCQ with his Cyber Dragon deck, and inspired me because I always loved the arts type. But I just knew it wasn't competitive inspired me to be like, you know what, I'm going to start playing Cyber Dragons because the deck looks awesome, it's super easy, it's a bit of a helmet deck, I will admit, but there's definitely some cool strategies you can implement. So anyway, uh, first duel, I'm going to do two duels in this one. Uh, opponent's playing Satellite Knights, I have no idea what Satellite Knights do, to be honest with you. They were before my time, they were in between my time. I played, I quit, Satellite Knights came along, left, and I came back. So, I know Cyber Dragons. I go into Nova, I go into Infinity. I don't know what Satel Knights do, but I know when Cyber Infinity kicks their ass. It kicks everyone's ass. So, <laughs> he goes for his play, I just negate. So, I'm like, nah, you can't do that. I figured he didn't have anything else that he could really do. So, I didn't want him to do anything. I go Gold Jet and Instant Fusion into uh, Nova. And I just OTK him with these Cyber Dragons. Uh, one thing I want to know is. Uh, the guy that played like top of WCQ, he does not play Golden Jet. I think that's an amazing card in the deck. It's a, it's instant rank five, so in my opinion, I, it's great. So I ro I do run Golden Jet, I, you know, some extra support the people who don't run. And then he goes, I use Dragon Souls and I negate. So that's the first duel. You know, that's pretty much game. Hey, how you guys with the second duel? I don't know, it's swapped. Okay, anyway. Uh, still playing my Cyber Dragons. He goes into his little Infernity deck, Archfiend type thing. He gets his Levier out. I'm like, okay, I'm kind of afraid of that back rope, but I got Electromagnetic Turtle on the Twin Twist there, so I'm good. I go Cyber Dragon, go Drake, go Nova, go Infinity. I take his Levier, because I figure that's the most important card for his plays right there. Uh, he top decks Infernity Break. Okay, cool. I go next. Uh... I just I just swing with the infinity because I'm like I want to just build some resources in hand right now. Uh, the one thing I do regret in this duel is not summoning Tomb Cyber Dragon. The only thing I regret. So I just negate his uh, Ferny Break. He goes Norden, gets his Norden Blaze, goes the Arc, you know, goes Silent Honor Arc, and I just go Electromagnetic Turtle. I'm like, whoa, hold up there, buddy. So after that, I go okay. Now I can bring out my Tomb Cyber Dragon. So, so prayer plan. Actually, pitch with this kaiju. Go to type of dragon. Go chimera attack. Go nova. Go infinity. Grab the kaiju and swing for game. Well, let's see. Not swing for game, but basically at this point, it's game. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, actually, let me see. I might be able to fit a third duel in this video. So, okay, so I'm here with my third duel. Uh, it's more obviously my third duel. Deck. This is the third duel I want to showcase you guys with. Uh, different build. I've, I'm still playtesting the deck, so I'm still in the updating phase. So a little bit of an updated build over here. So he goes El Shadal. Uh, I, I can't pronounce that name, but it's a machine type. That's all I know. So I'm like, I am good to go right now. I have Cyber Dragons galore in my hand. Cyber Dragon Core. Grab another Repair Plant. Go Chimera Tech Forges Dragon. He grabs the El Shadal Fusion, and then he just gets it back with Falco. And I'm like, you know what? That's fine. Uh, he just sets it face down again. Next turn, he goes with his uh, dragon, bounces, and gets out wind up. At this point, I am kind of on the ropes. In my head, I am on the ropes because I am like, oh shit, I could lose this. <laughs> I'm like, I know he has the machine type fusion up there, so I'm still good, but I'm, I'm a little, I'm, I'm a little tilted right now. He just did, dealt a whole bunch of damage to me. I think I have, like in my head, I'm like, I got one turn, I gotta do this. So I go repair plant. I grab the Galaxy Soldier, give him his, give him the Kaiju, he grabs his Trap Card, I go Cyber Dragon, get out the Galaxy Soldier, and key to key. I just go for the, the Summon, I get my Kaikinir Tech out, go for my Rampage Dragon, activate his effect to dump a couple cards, and that's the OTK right there. So, that's the one thing I really like about this deck. It's I did get lucky with the El Shadal matchup, but... It's just, there's such a, a large toolbox that you can work with, and it's just, it's kind of derpy. You're just like, oh, I have an out to this, I have an out to that, I have an out to this. And it's so accessible at your fingertips. I rarely draw a brick with this deck. It's super consistent, and uh, I'm actually in the process of building it right now, just because of how much I love the deck. 
and it's definitely something I'd want to bring to locals, possibly a regionals when that starts up. Of course, I have to see what the meta is going to be, but yeah, I'm probably running DDDs and Cyber Dragons as my main deck. Yeah, I'm that type of guy. But uh, for right now, none of the other archetypes are really interesting to me, except for Christrons look pretty cool. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you have any deck suggestions, suggest them down below. I'll check them out, try to play them. Uh, see you guys next time. Bye.